And that is 30 crates of eggs sold so far. How many do we have left, Daddy? Perfect. That should last us the day. Oh, where's our new farmhand? Were they not supposed to come today? Late on their first day? Already? Seriously, Daddy? You need to stop hiring these incompetent people. We need someone that's actually going to be useful for once. Yeah, I know. But... You've been working a little too hard lately. And you need to take care of your health. I don't want you to overexert yourself. Do you remember what Dr. Stanfield said? Yeah, I guess so. But I told you, we don't need a farmhand. Well, not exactly. You know that I can take care of the farm just fine on my own. No, it's not too much work. Not at all. I grew up doing this. Look, Bobby's here. Do you want me to take care of him? Yeah, I can... Oh. Oh my god. What happened here? The new farm... You're the new farmhand. Well. <laughs> no wonder you're so late. Did you trip over a rake or something? What? No, Daddy, I'm not being rude at all. Oh, yes, I guess I can go take care of this. <laughs> Follow me this way. God, I can't believe it's your first day and you've already injured yourself. Are you sure that you're capable of handling this job? You haven't done anything yet. You do? Hmm, I don't know. You're not exactly showing that very well. What happened to you anyways? Hmm, so you actually did take a pretty bad fall, huh? Well, maybe you shouldn't have wore shorts on your first day. <laughs> Just take a seat here on the barrel. I have a first aid kit somewhere over here. Mm, yeah. This won't be the first or the last time you hurt yourself. This farm can be a lot to handle. There are plenty of tasks to finish in one day. You're up for it? Just stay still. I'm going to disinfect the wound with some sterile wipes. Yeah, this isn't looking too good. You need to be careful of your surroundings next time. Especially over here. <laughs> it's not too late for you to turn back. I'm sure we'll find someone to replace you in no time. What? No, I'm not being mean. I'm literally helping you with your wound. If anything, I'm just being honest with you. And I'm letting you know that this is tough work. And the last thing that I need you to do is distract me. <laughs> if you're so sure. Let me just pat the wound with some gauze. Oh, this doesn't look too good. Hmm? Is it just me and my father? Why do you care? <sighs> yeah. Yeah, everyone knows that. It is just him and I. I mean, I don't really have any siblings, and my mother is 
practically non-existent. <clears throat> but I don't really care. I mean, we have our horses and goats and chickens keeping us company. Not to mention everyone else in town. They've always been very kind to us. But then again, my dad, he's, well, he's very generous and sweet with everyone. But anyways, enough about me. I want to know about you. What made you take this job? Do you even know anything about farming? No? I'm really starting to question the reason behind my dad hiring you. Is it just because you're good looking? Mm. Yeah, I guess it was a compliment. What about it? To make me take it back. You must be used to scoring plenty of jobs even without experience, huh? Well, no one's ever lasted. Everyone ends up finding it a little bit too overwhelming and then they leave. Yeah, it's a pattern at this point. Constantly happening over and over again, but it doesn't really bother me. Oh yeah? You think I'm a little harsh. So you're blaming me for that? It's not my fault they can't handle a few words. But I mean, isn't that expected? I need to get to know the person that's going to be in charge when I'm gone. <laughs> what? Do you think my life revolves around the farm? I bartend on weekends. So I'm not exactly here all the time. And I need someone to help my father whenever I'm not present. Alright, I'm just gonna put this plaster on and you'll be all good. At least the bleeding stopped. There you go. Please try and be more careful from here on out. I don't want to have to take care of you on top of our animals as well. Oh, hey Lily. This is our new farmhand. Would you mind showing them around? Oh, your mom needs you home. Yeah, yeah, that's perfectly okay. You did more than enough. Thank you for helping me today. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow. All right, I guess I will show you around. Hmm? Lily? Yeah. Her mother's the sweetest lady. She's the owner of Paula's. We usually sell her most of her fruits and vegetables. Everyone in town loves them. <laughs> right. I forgot that you're new. Why... why did you choose to move here, of all places? Is that so? You wanted a change. Usually all of our newcomers leave after the first month. Let's see how long you last. <laughs> I guess I did say that already, didn't I? Oh well. What's that? You have a feeling that you're going to be sticking around. <laughs> Aren't you confident? Why is that? <laughs> what are you doing? My hair's in my face. Oh, um. Well, <laughs> next time warn me before you suddenly touch my face. Why are you looking at me like that? Pretty. 
you you find me pretty <laughs> where is this coming from do you think that by sweet talking me I'll let you stick around easily mm. well maybe it is working just a little bit although I don't know if you deserve to stay after your clumsy little introduction Maybe you should prove me wrong. <laughs> okay, you're you're a pretty good kisser. <clears throat> this is not how I imagined my day would turn out. <laughs> no, I'm not complaining. I'm just not exactly used to kissing our farm hands. It's a little bit new to me. But... <laughs> I bet you weren't expecting to kiss me either, were you? Hmm. Who would have thought? Me being a little bit harsh on you would actually work? Well. I suppose maybe you can stay. Just for a little bit. I'm curious to see how long you'll last. And don't think that I'm going to take it easy on you just because we shared a kiss. I mean, sure, you are a pretty good kisser, but... I don't want to kiss the person that's going to kiss 50 other girls in town. You're not. Are you sure about that? What? What are you talking about? There is another reason as to why you took this job? And what reason is that? <laughs> you... You had your eye on me. How did you even know who I am? I mean, this is my first time meeting you. I think. Oh. You knew that the farm owner's daughter is cute. <laughs> well, I wasn't expecting that. So this was your plan all along? Come here, pretend that you fell, hurt yourself so I can patch you up and then kiss me. And tell me that you're here for me. If that was your plan, then... <laughs> I guess it worked a little bit. Hmm. I guess... Since we... Since we're already here, another kiss wouldn't hurt. Yeah. Yeah, I do think you're cute. But don't let that get to your head. I won't be complimenting you every day. It's not really my thing. <laughs> what? You think you can change that? 
people don't be so sure. There's still a lot that I need to know about you. And I don't usually kiss people that I meet this easily and quickly, but well, something about you is different. I'm intrigued. And I want to find out. And obviously, there's a pretty good reason that my dad hired you out of all the other people that wanted to come and work. You don't even have... <laughs> you don't even have a lot of experience. I mean, sure, you said you did your research and all of that, but still, it's not close to the real thing, is it? But that's fine. I'll help you. We can do everything together. Starting now. There's not much time to waste. Sure, yeah. We'll have one more kiss before we go. <laughs> oh shit. Someone's coming. That's probably my dad. <laughs> Alright, we should probably head out before we get caught. <laughs>